Morning guys, July 11th, 2024. This is where I got a call from a customer of mine that um, one of his air conditioners isn't working. He's got two floors over there. I have replaced the first floor furnace and um, AC recently, probably six months ago maybe. Put a new furnace in and a condensing unit. Maybe maybe three, four months ago, something like that. But anyway, the second floor one, um, it's an old vintage uh, carrier unit, a little tiny thing. It's got a gas furnace up there. Well, I guess it's not working. He said he thinks it needs a refrigerant. I think probably might need more than that. I don't know. We're going to find out when we go there. I work for these people before. This the the owners of the daycares that I work for. So, um, you know, older, elderly, elderly couple. Well, not too old, but getting up there. They like their house comfortable. They want the AC working. I told him last time I was there we should have probably, you know, re replaced both systems, but he wanted to wait on the f second floor unit. I might have added, I might have added gas to it in the past, maybe. I told him to shut it off. We'll see if he keep, we'll see if he shut it off. If he was keeping it running. I know it's R22 for sure. It's an older. Probably 30 year vintage equipment type of stuff. Really old shit. Hopefully I don't gotta change it out. I mean I just did one just what did one yesterday, just about wiped my ass out in two days. I'm not getting any younger for this shit. I'm not getting any younger, Miss Molly. Oh I'm getting to be an old buzzer here. I'm getting to be an old buzzard, you know. Yeah. We like an old seagull. Wobbling around. Yeah, so it's almost been in a year. Oh, that's fucking water. That must have been in it over there. Here's the other one we put in. the vent throw off yeah nothing yeah, no hot air coming out of it at all what's the question's not running Boy, she's an old bitch, huh? Yeah. I wonder what size. We'll have to check it, see if there's even any gas in it. <laughs> it's a tiny one, huh? Yeah. I think you should replace it. Might be a 24. Well. Let's see if there's any gas in it. Yeah. This is the model. I, mean, I think it's a two two tonner. Look how tiny it is, huh? Absolutely. Shit. I might be able to put some in, but I don't know how long it's gonna last. Just to get you by. You wanna juice it up? Huh? I won't be here until uh, we're leaving for. Uh... Oh. I won't. I won't be able to get it done before then. I mean, this is. No. You know. I'd wait I'm a couple it. of weeks out before I could do it. Well, that's fine. Let me juice it up. Yeah, juice it up. And see how hopefully it lasts. Yeah, let's do that. And then uh, I'll get over here and change it out. I'm okay. gonna have to get upstairs and see what. I think that's a, a gas furnace up there. 
Uh, and it, that's a gas furnace up yeah, there. Yeah, it's yeah. A gas furnace, yeah. Up to the roof. And you ever get the chimney guy to come? Oh, yeah, twice. What, what did he say was the issue up there? I couldn't get much out of him. Did uh, he seal it? He sealed, he, uh, he cleaned it out. And uh, he said, it's all right. And I, I haven't heard anything in those. In those what uh, about the, how the birds get in? Did you ask him? He didn't seem to. Uh, no response there. Huh? No response. No response? Yeah, he, he didn't have any idea how the birds got in. Really? Yeah. Well, they're getting in somehow. He said, well, he, he said, uh, I've been down here to the other units and they, they, they did what you're doing, you know, sealing that little wire cage, I guess it is. Yeah, so he did seal it? So he did do that, yeah. Okay, so maybe that's... But I had to push him for it. You know? Yeah, what a... What a it didn't seem I had to push. Didn't seem like he was too user-friendly there. No. Exactly. All right, let me... He wants to juice it up, Miss Molly. He wants to juice it up. For now. All right, we're going to start it. Put some gas in it. This is a fucking noisy bitch. Oh. Did you shut the thermostat off? You must have. You want me to up it? I yeah, it's not it? it's not pulled in, the thermostat. No, you gotta turn the thermostat down so it runs. I'll turn it down to, it's at 71 right now. It must, it must be satisfied because it's not running. Yeah, let me take a look. Yeah, turn it down so it runs and we'll charge it up. Okay. I'm just gonna douche it up for now and He's gonna put a new system in, but for now, get him by for the weekend. Or maybe I don't know how long the charge is gonna last, but I'm gonna put some. We're gonna do shit up for the guy. A little douche will do you, Mama. Tomorrow, 22 in there. Get him by for now. Gonna have to replace this, and there's a gas furnace on the second floor. Not gonna be easy. Do it. Make some do re me. It's gonna be a bitch. To put changing this thing out. It's a little two tonner. So I'm thinking it's a yeah, it's a two ton unit. Kind of like my ex girlfriend. Ain't worth a shit. <laughs> These things suck. These things suck. Right, let's see if we. Should fucking bet you any money that break is shit. Maximum fuse size twenty amps. I got a twenty. Yeah, it was. I was working at the... One of Listen the to this one. Lady had a... Just bought this house, right? Yeah. She had uh, two brand new systems put, to put in. Yeah. And, uh... Unknown caller. 
the second floor cooling. Mm -hmm. um, condensate in the line, uh, condensate drain in the line wasn't connected. It went in, it went into the wall and it, it got disconnected in the wall. Oh Jesus! So uh, the old lady that was there, yeah, she probably never went up on the second floor to run the AC because she was old. She, she's living on the first floor. Yep. So the new owner got it, got the air conditioning. You know, went to run the AC. Sure. Flipping water, dumping down in the basement. Couldn't oh. figure it out. Had to open up the wall. Man. Yeah. That's a big job. Well, yeah, she got all flipping holes in the wall now and shit. I mean, I found it and fixed it, but it's like, yeah, but where the hell is this water coming from? She, she didn't notice the water coming, so that. Well, the lady, the old lady, wasn't going up and running the second floor AC. The guy never. The guy didn't run it long enough, probably, to figure it out. I'd say about over half don't use the second floor. Not easy. I'm not a big fan of these things, I'll tell you. No. no I have a lot of problems with them. That was the um, technology at the time. Well, I don't know. I don't think these breakers are designed to be out in the weather. I don't think. I don't, that's why they. That's that a home. cheap little ass flipper. Yeah. Uh, breaker, you know? Yeah. Alright, hopefully you can start it now. Charge it. B-Vent hot and cooling and uh, this is the return here well, I could probably put that T up there come over with another piece and drop down here well, the gas pipe is gonna have to be redone and put a gas furnace here facing this way with the uh, a coil on top all the piping's going out the back we'll swap it around so the piping comes around this way do the drain over and out. Put another pan in. All right now he's got cooling, but for how long I don't know. It's uh, pretty flipping hot up here. A little two tonner. It's a little tiny, little tiny furnace he's got here. A little sixty thousand is all you need up here. figure it out get all my measurements and stuff here and 